David Rawlinson, and the badges are from David Argarden. Uh, this is the gap from where they're coming through. And then they're coming along here where you can see the sandy pathway. And they started to dig underneath the garden. trees at the back here and that have all been cut down. You can see just over the fence there's a big tree that they've cut down as well. And David Rollington, uh, we've recently bought the property and this is where the badgers have come into the garden. Hi, my name is Simon. Um, I live on Sandown Place, directly behind. I don't know what's your name. Dave. Dave. Um, when we moved in here, there was trees surrounding here. We knew there was badgers here, but we told us we were going to get rid of them. It was a problem. Um, now, we have moved in about 30 yards away from the garden. This is how we've left the garden after the company's been in and done them. Um, they say it's safe for my children to come in here and play. What's down there? It's just a big. Um, these are the size of the trees. What was here? We said we had to move all these to get a digger in, which was only a little one digger, weren't it? Uh, you know, it weren't very big. But we said the the, 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 the sets were underneath here, but there's apparently there's meant to be meshing down on this ground, and there's there's none. <clears throat> to prevent them coming back like I mean they have got rid of them but we haven't done anything to prevent them from stopping out of the gardens they'll just come back carry disease <laughs> <coughs> These are the man-made sets that the 